Peter William Hamm was a Welsh singer, songwriter and guitarist, primarily recognised for having been the lead singer-composer of the 1970s rock group Bad Fingers hit songs, No Matter What, Day After Day, and Baby Blue. He also co-wrote the ballad Without You, a worldwide number one hit for Harry Nilsson and it has become a standard song as covered by hundreds of artists consistently throughout the years since. Ham was granted two Ivor Novello Awards related to the song in 1973. Ham committed suicide in 1975 as a result of band-related issues such as label and manager problems, as well as lack of funds. Early life, Ham was born in Swansea, Wales. He formed a local rock group called the Panthers around 1961. This group would undergo several name and lineup changes before it became the Ivies in 1965. The band was relocated to London by the Mojo's manager, Bill Collins, in 1966, and they continued to perform for three years throughout the United Kingdom. As it was, Ham eventually became the prominent songwriter for the band, as a Revox tape recorder was made available by Collins to encourage him. Ray Davis of the Kinks took an initial interest in the group, although tracks produced by Davis did not surface commercially until decades later. In 1968, the Ivies came to the attention of Mal Evans and were eventually signed to the Beatles' Apple Records label after approval from all four Beatles, who were reportedly impressed by the band's songwriting abilities. In Badfinger, the Ivies changed their name to Badfinger with the single release of Come and Get It, a composition written by Paul McCartney, and it became a worldwide top ten hit. Ham had initially protested against using a non-original to promote the band, as he had gained confidence in the group's compositions, but he was quickly convinced of the springboard effect of having a likely hit single. His own creative perseverance paid off eventually, as his No Matter What composition became another top ten worldwide hit after its release in late 1970. He followed up writing two more worldwide hits with Day After Day, and Baby Blue. His greatest songwriting success came with his co-written composition Without You a worldwide number one when it was later covered by Harry Nilsson and released in 1972. The song has since become a ballad standard and is covered by hundreds of singers from many genres worldwide. An Ivan Novello Award for Song of the Year was issued in 1973 along with Grammy nominations. George Harrison used Ham's talents for a number of album sessions including the All Things Must Pass album and for other Apple Records artists' recordings. This friendship culminated with Ham's acoustic guitar duet on Here Comes the Sun with Harrison at the concert for Bangladesh in 1971, later portrayed in the theatrical film of the concert. In 1972, Badfinger was picked up by Warner Brothers. Records as the Apple Records label was crumbling and it seemed the band was primed for major recognition. Death, during the Warner Brothers. Records era from 1973 Euro 75, Badfinger became embroiled in many internal, financial, and managerial problems and their music was stifled. By 1975, with no income and the band's business manager uncommunicative, Ham became despondent and he hanged himself in the garage of his Surrey home. Ham was aged 27 at the time. His suicide fell just three days shy of his 28th birthday. He left behind a pregnant girlfriend, who gave birth to their daughter one month after his death. His suicide note had the statement, I will not be allowed to love and trust everybody. This is better. It also included an accusatory blast toward Badfinger's business manager, Stan Poli. P.S. Stan Poli is a soulless bastard. I will take him with me. News of Ham's death was not widely disseminated at the time, as no public comment was made by the Beatles, Apple Court Limited, or Warner Brothers. Records. Legacy Ham is often credited as being one of the earliest purveyors of the power pop genre. His most widespread effect in popular music is The Ballad Without You, written with Bad Finger Band mate Tom Evans. Collections of Ham's home demo recordings have been posthumously released, 1997's Seven Park Avenue, 1999's Golders Green and 2013's The Keyhole Street Diamos 1966 a Euro 67. On April 27, 2013, Ham was commemorated by his hometown's first official heritage blue plaque. The unveiling ceremony took place at Swansea's High Street Station, 
located at Ivy Place, on what would have been Ham's 66th birthday. Following the unveiling, which was performed by Ham's daughter Petra, a tribute concert featuring two original Ivy's members was held at Swansea's Grand Theatre. Discography 7 Park Avenue, Golders Green, The Keyhole Street Diamos 1966 a Euro 67, Ham also appeared as a guest artist on, The Concert for Bangladesh, All Things Must Pass by George Harrison, It Don't Come Easy by Ringo Starr, Living in the Material World by George Harrison. Compositions of Note, No Matter What, Without You. Day After Day, Baby Blue. See also, 27 Club, of which Ham is a member, Category, Pete Ham. References. External links, Pete Ham's official website, Pledge Music page for Keyhole Street, Pete Ham at the Internet Movie Database, Pete Ham at Find a Grave.